Welcome to Gamasa News Indore. Today we have a special guest from France, Ms. Gail Linhart. She is working uh, with the French Language Institute and she is from France. Ms. Gail, uh, welcome to our studio. We would like to have some question with you. Uh, when exactly you came to India and what was the reason behind this? Okay, so, so my name is Gaël. Uh, I'm French. I was born in south of France uh, uh, some years before. Mm -hmm. And uh, I do some studies in biology uh, to, to at the beginning. Okay. And uh, after four years, uh, like a biologist, I decided to work for one artistic uh, uh, singer, very famous. So this thing gave me an opportunity to travel a lot. I visit uh, maybe 35 countries. And step by step, I, I met some very important people. And some people work for French Embassy. And at this moment, they gave me this uh, opportunity to come in India uh, to promote French higher education and to promote French language. So uh, really? no hesitation. And uh, I, I came in India so to become French, uh, French teacher for Alliance Française and to become the first uh, campus France manager for French Embassy in Indore. Very nice. And uh, currently, what you are doing? Uh, are you still with the Campus France or something else? Alors, I work with Campus France uh, for one, uh, one, year, one year, sorry. And after I leave, because I decided to work uh, for my own. And so now I am French teacher for uh, DAVV, SGSITS. And uh, since uh, some uh, weeks uh, for uh, Delhi Public School in Rao, uh, and I have one uh, big project. Uh, it is to develop my own institute. Uh, I want to open my institute in May, and to receive people to learn French language for each level, okay, A1, A2, B1, B2, and to put some French spirit in this institute, not only to uh, to learn uh, just to open one book and to do some exercise, but to have some discussion and to talk about my culture, my country. Uh, yes, to maybe to open open mind and uh, to, to, to put something more. Yes. Uh, you know, the scope of French is going very high in India, like people now focusing on foreign languages, such as German, French. So, what is the current scope of learning French in India and uh, how students will get benefit? Yes, so French language, yes, is very important uh, from now uh, because it's the second most popular language in Europe. It is the third most uh, language for business. So, if you have uh, this idea maybe to work abroad one day or to do a part of your studies, uh, even if we have many uh, programs taught in English, it's always better if you want to go in France, for example, to know a little French language uh, for exactly. your daily life, uh, to have uh, some uh, new friends very quickly. Uh, and the employability is very high when you know French language, because you have to know uh, more than 1,000 uh, French companies are in India. And these companies want some uh, people with these skills uh, knowing French language uh, in their company. Uh, so, of course, uh, you will have more and more opportunities if you know French language. Uh, I repeat, uh, French language, we speak French language in all continents, in more than 40 countries now, huh? in Canada. In 40 countries, country country. countries. Uh, not only in France. So, so big scope. It exactly. means 20% uh, of the world is speaking French. Exactly, exactly. All right, all right. And uh, what is the scope? And opportunities of uh, going to France for higher education. You know, recently French Education Minister visited India and they signed an MOU with the uh, HRD Minister mm -hmm. and Central Government. And uh, they have uh, given their intention that they want to increase the number of students. I, I think uh, their target is 20,000 students. So, what is the scope if if student, Indian students will go to France, it will give them any benefit? Yes, yes of course. The, the, the links between India and France are very well, very strong. 
and uh, the French president say always welcome to Indian students to come in France. Uh, first reason, because you have to know education is quite similar between India and France. All is recognized. For example, you can start one master in France and to do your second year in France or in India. Huh? You have the choice, all is recognized. Multiple country program. Exactly, huh? multiple. Uh, so, of course, for example, if you are a diplomat in France uh, with one MBA, after we always we tell, and it is the truth, you have uh, in less than six months the opportunity to have uh, the best job and to win the big, big salary, more than 20,000 uh, euros per month. Exactly. Uh, so big uh, packages. Big packages, big packages exactly. Exactly. It is uh, one truth, yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, how is India? Like uh, you have been to 35 countries and uh, you decided to start your own language institute in India. Mm -hmm. So why you choose India and how you like India and if you compare India with France, you find any similarities or any difference? Oh. Yes, difficult question, but yeah. uh, so of course huh, I like my countries, huh, I like uh, uh, the countries where I born, mm -hmm. but maybe I can tell India, India is life. Yeah. True human being alive mm -hmm. are in India, not in France, not in Europe for me. Okay. Uh, you can see in the street all the colors, colors represent lives. Difficult to see and to find the same thing in France. And me, I need, I need these colors of life, I need this spirituality, I need this, uh, this kind of deep, deep things. So that's why I decided to live in India and to do my best, to, to bring my knowledge, uh, to teach my maternal language and uh, maybe to put uh, more and more smile on the face of Indians, uh, thanks to uh, the French language. Okay. Yes. So you, you are starting your own language institute from uh, next week exactly and uh, what is your plan when you will like how many level or what is the fees structure okay alors, so uh, i will start uh, of course with a one level a two level uh, b1 or b2 uh, because some uh, students i know uh, they follow some program at school or in alliance française maybe yet and they want to continue so i can adapt uh, with their level no problem without that and maybe my, my thing is maybe to improve their accent, they improve their uh, discussion in, in, in French because I know it's difficult for one French teacher, Indian, Indian French teacher, it's difficult to teach uh, French uh, speaking with a good accent. So exactly. maybe it is my focus uh, to do my best because I think what is important if they go abroad someone can understand what they want to ask, what they want to tell, and for now maybe they are very, maybe very good to do some exercise of grammar and all, but some difficulties to speak. Exactly. Yes. Accent is a big issue. Exactly. And as a native speaker, I think uh, you can uh, help them for exact accent. Exactly. I would like to develop some uh, uh, meeting of discussion. Why not? Uh, many programs with many games. I want something uh, attractive. Definitely. Yes. So today, as you can see, Miss Gail Linhart from France, uh, how she came to India and uh, she worked with the Campus France and Embassy of France. Then she resigned her job and started her own language institute for well-being of prospective French uh, students. Many thanks for your time. And thanks, thanks for you. Thank you very mm -hmm. much. Thank you. Subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for more updates.